time for the Make Code Minute. For the Make Code Minute today, we're going to look at running a solenoid using the Cricut. So what I've done is selected from the Cricut category this Cricut Analog Write Drive 1 to 0. And what this is going to do is it's going to tell our uh, solenoid drive, and we have the four drives on the Cricut right here, 1, 2, 3, and 4, uh, to send anywhere from 0 to 1023 uh, as the value. So this is the full, uh, full 5 volts at the full current that it can supply. So now what I'm going to do is add a little bit of a delay. So I'm going to grab the pause loop from loops. And uh, this is going to, let's, let's delay this for 100 milliseconds. Actually, this default is good. Uh, then I will duplicate the Cricut Analog Write Drive 1 and send it down to 0. So what this means is we're going to get this little tenth of a second tick uh, of the solenoid um, energizing and flicking the little uh, shaft out. And now I'll add another delay. And this can be the sort of pause between clicks. So let's make this uh, about half a second. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is download. And I'm going to save that over to the board. Okay, so I'm downloading the code. And now I've got the solenoid plugged into drive one. All right, so with that code right there, you'll see the solenoid gets energized and clicks just for a tenth of a second and then returns every half of a second. And that is how you drive a solenoid using make code on Cricut with Circuit Playground Express. Time for the make code minute.